In this video, I'm going to show you how to use HTML BG color to apply background color to HTML elements, and then I'm going to tell you not to do it ever again, and instead use CSS, because that's much more flexible, much more future-proof, and easier to maintain. And we're getting started right now. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. It's Bjorn from Higher Learning Lab, where we help you get better at coding so you can earn more for yourself, for your clients, or for your business. If it's your first time here, make sure you click on the subscribe button and then click on the bell notification icon so you're notified when we publish more awesome tutorials for you. And with that out of the way, let's get into the screen capture of this tutorial. I'll see you there. Hey, it's Bjorn from Higher Learning Lab. In this HTML tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to use the BG color parameter in HTML. And after I show you how to do it, I'm gonna tell you not to do it ever again because it's not actually supported in HTML5. So since HTML5 is the direction the industry is going, it's the new standard, has been for a number of years, and they're no longer supporting BG color, I recommend that you don't use it. I'm still gonna show you how to do it, but then learn the CSS, which I will also show you in this video. So I've got a simple HTML page created on the left, and we see how it renders on the right. And just to add the, the BG color is really easy. To add BG color to a table, we type in BG color equals open and close quotes, and then we enter a color. So we can use the word for the color. So green, for example, makes the background green. We can use RGB values, or we can even use hex code. Just by typing in the hex code, like so, we can define the color of the table. Now, a limitation of this, um, well, a big limitation is it's no longer supported by HTML5, but another limit limitation is it doesn't work on all HTML elements. So we add this to the P tag so that contains this paragraph, and we refresh this page, and it doesn't change the background color because BG color does not work on the paragraph tag. So what I recommend you do is learn the CSS, and it's really easy. I'm just going to show you right now how to add a style in the head section of your HTML page. We open and close the style tag. It's going to delete this from here. Then we select what we want to style. In this case, we want to change the background color of the table. We're going to type in background color, colon, and then add a value. So I'm going to make it yellow. And then we're going to add, I'm going to select the paragraph, make the background color of the paragraph green, save this file, refresh this page, and now we see we have yellow and green. So where the BG color parameter failed in the HTML in making the background color of the paragraph different, CSS was successful. And that's how easy it is to use the BG color attribute in HTML. And it's also how easy it is to apply background colors with CSS. It's a lot easier, more future-proof, easier to maintain, so stick to the CSS route. But all in all, I hope this video helps you. If you haven't done so yet, click on the subscribe button, then click on the bell notification icon so you're notified when we publish more awesome content. And then click on that card that just appeared in the top right of this video for some awesome resources. And until next time, keep crushing it, and I will see you in the next video.